guys, here we are, the final episode of Arkham City. We defeated Ray Shao Ghul. We defeated Hugo Strange. Completely deactivated Protocol 10, saving who who knows how many people in Arkham City. Now. We have to rescue Talia from Joker. Let's get right into it. All air units report in. Cease attack and return to base immediately. Repeat, return to base immediately. Of course, Joker wouldn't make anything easy. <sighs> Joker never makes anything too incredibly easy, in my opinion. You're leaving ladies waiting, Batman. Oh, I was about to say. I'll see you soon. <laughs> Bye. Take your seat, Batman. The show is uh, about to begin. Let's just talk about this. <laughs> now you want to talk. Too late, Batman. Give me the cure. But you've already got the cure. Talia, no!
Problem solved. You didn't need to... Why? You would never do it. You left me no choice. There's always a choice. I had to save you. Harley Quinn stole it for him. I took it back. It's over. Wait a minute. Surprise! <laughs> oh, Mr. J, you look perfect. You fell for the old. So how do you keep a secret from the world's greatest detective? Well, do you know? You stick it right in front of him, right under his long, pointy nose. And wait! Joker wants you to think he's sick. Then wait! Gotcha! You fell for the old fake Joker gang, Batman! Tell you! Oh. I'm sorry, beloved. I didn't know. <laughs> Encore! More! Bravo! <laughs> it wasn't never you. <laughs> Not always. Well, sometimes. <laughs> uh, confusing, isn't it? I know I'd want to know just what the hell is going on if I were you. <laughs> Let's just say, sure. in times like these, it's important to keep up <coughs> appearances. But first, if you would be so kind, hand over my jaw. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, for one night only, standing in for your duty <laughs> and doing a damn fine job of it, I give you you weren't even supposed to be in here, Carl. Why sign up with Joker? Ease. The role of a lifetime! One last chance. Oh, light, not that! The final act's just starting. It's a doozy. To be playing with knives? What the hell are you doing, Matt? <laughs> You're supposed to be killing that man, remember? Oh! <sighs> 
Oh shit, son. Making me late for my spa treatment. I mean, uh -oh. it's not like you've got a girl to save anymore, is it? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Too soon. Would a change of scenery help? That's a big button. That's a that's a matter of big button. Gotham in hell. <laughs> it's not even breakfast. <laughs> but so what? We all know you'll save me. Every decision you've ever made ends with death and misery. People die. I stop you. You'll just break out and do it again. <laughs> Think of it as a running No! Are you happy now? Do you want to know something funny? 
Even after everything you've done, I would have saved you. <laughs> that actually is pretty funny. happened in there. post-traumatic stress, it was just, it was like the thousand yard, I think it was, I think it's called like a thousand, uh, or like, I think it is like a thousand yard stare, where he just looked off in the distance and he just saw, well the things that he saw, he was just like, you know, and plus about, probably because he was like, you know, I always thought it was going to be always him being locked up and he ex he escapes, be rinse and repeat, but I guess he never thought he would actually die. Oh man. This, this is really well done. I love the story. The ending was kind of anticlimactic. I thought you'd fight. Um, when I played this um, a few years ago, I thought you'd fight Raish Ghul again, but nope. I don't know. I guess probably because you know they didn't want you to have to fight him twice, because I guess it really didn't make any sense. Hence why they didn't make you fight. Joker twice. They only made you fight Joker once. Or Clayface, anyways. <laughs> well, I guess that's all I got. I guess that's all there is to this. I mean, thanks guys so much for um, watching. You have one missed call. Call received three hours ago. <clears throat> This world seems Joker right. singing, huh? Only you can make the darkness bright. Only you and you alone can thrill me like you do and fill my heart with love for only you <laughs> only you can make this change in me for it's true you are my 
understand the magic that you do. You're my dream come true, my one and only you. <laughs> only wow. you can make this change in me, for it's true. You are my destiny. It makes sense why he would actually be singing that song. The magic that you do. Because he's basically the song. The song is basically him saying Batman doesn't understand that that it's fate and destiny that they've always been pinned against each other a lot. That. No matter how much he tries to change it, no matter how much he tries to deny it, they were pretty much made for each other. They were legitimately pretty much made for each other. Because in the comics, Joker and Batman always had this connection. And even in the newer comics, you see, aww, Rock City Bat Beast, <laughs> really? But, um,. Oh, someone had twins. Um, but yeah. I mean, the way it looks, Batman, Batman and Joker have a connection. Something, something made them, something horrific made them the way they are. And... I don't know, I guess they're just meant for each other. I guess that makes any sense but yeah um so thank you guys so much for watching this walkthrough um if you liked it uh, well, uh, uh give it a thumbs up um uh, leave a comment if you want to subscribe if you haven't already and as always i'll catch you guys the next one.